Let's factor the polynomial completely. If the polynomial is prime, say so. Here we have a trinomial, x squared minus 5x minus 24. It fits that nice trinomial format. There's no greatest common factor to pull out. If it does factor, it will factor as two binomials. Now the leading coefficient here is 1, and so we know that we should use x and x for our leading coefficients in the factorization because x times x is our only possibility for x squared. Now with the second part, here we're looking for factors of negative 24 that sum to negative 5. Now to get a product of negative 24, we know that one of these factors must be positive and the other negative. As we work our way using trial and error through factors of negative 24, we can see that if we use a 3 times a negative 8, we will indeed get a product of negative 24 and 3 plus that negative 8 is going to give us our sum of negative 5. So the correct coefficients to use here at this point or are positive 3 and negative 8. So we'll put our plus 3 in place, our minus 8, and just a quick check of our inner and outer products, 3x minus 8x does indeed yield the negative 5x in the middle. So the correct factorization of x squared minus 5x minus 24 is x plus 3 times x minus 8.